We are here at WrestleCon in we're here in WrestleCon in Secaucus, New Jersey. My guest at this time, one of the most legendary journalists in wrestling history, Mr. Bill After. Bill, it's a pleasure and an honor to have you standing by my side. It is a pleasure and honor to be speaking with you and all your uh, uh, sending the message out to your millions and millions of viewers. We'll get there. But we're here in New Jersey. We're here at WrestleMania weekend, the biggest weekend of the year for the industry, to do some investigating and figure out what exactly everybody's Montreal theories are. Could Bret Hart have been in on it? Could it have been a work from day one? How much? To what degree? We have a panel of a dozen people spending hours talking about it, and it's only right that I present a copy here to Mr. Bill Apter. Thank you so very much. And to get Bill Apter's thoughts on this, because... Take credit card or we do take credit card, but you don't have to pay for that. You don't have to really. That. No, you. complimentary on the house. Thank you so much. I think you've earned it after all of us have grown up with you with the after mags. I may by give the you. Way, by the way, I thank you for saying that. But I was one guy on a team of dozens of people that put that magazine together. But I was the guy out in the front lines. So I should I should have copies for like Matt Brock and Liz Hunter and everybody else. Well, at least for Stu Sachs and Craig Peters and Brandy Mankevich and Dan Shockett, who's no longer with us. He uh, died at a very young age of uh, cancer. Certainly a great publication. Their, their memories will be with us for a long, long time. First bad guy reporter. There you go. After his passing, Eddie Elner took that well, call. Some people may consider me a bad guy reporter based on some of the subject matter in here, but you have an opinion. You have your own theory. What is your theory on Montreal? First, I'll say it in my Bret Hart imitation. You know, they said to me... No, that's it. My opinion from that day on was who was in on it. My totally non-educated, nobody told me this. I think that WWE was in a bad financial state at that time. And they had to lose Bret Hart. And I think, again, my opinion, that all the people involved in that knew that that was going to take place. Fits like a perfect story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's my, that's my opinion. I could be 100% wrong. I could be 50% wrong, but that's my opinion. There's a lot of other people that, that agree with you, though, and one of them that we talk about briefly on this DVD is Jerry the King Lawler. We have some footage from an interview that he did, and, and it's very interesting because I'm sure you were covering back in the day when something similar happened with Jerry Lawler and the late great Andy Kaufman. Uh, well, I was. do you know that I was the guy who put them together? I, I did not know, know that. You did not know that. So Andy Kaufman used to come to... Uh, the garden on uh, the once a month Monday nights, and Vince McMahon Sr. didn't want him involved at all. He was so anti-Hollywood back then still, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, he came over to me. He knew who I was, Andy Kaufman. And after the matches, he came back to my apartment on the subway. This is when he was a big star on Taxi. And people were talking to him. And that night at about 1 a.m. in the morning, I said, you know what? I got a friend in... Memphis, they're way ahead of the curve. His name is Jerry Lawler. I'm going to call him. He says, 1 o'clock in the morning. So he's a wrestler. He's just getting up. He's just coming in. So we called him. They got on the phone. And that's how everything started. In all the books on Jerry Lawler, I'm credited with that. Tremendous. Well, certainly you've been very instrumental in some major, major incidents in pro wrestling. And Absolutely. And, and uh, thank you very much, Montreal, the Montreal Theory. The Montreal Theory. And I'm going to go home and check this out. And you can check it out on MontrealTheory.com. Purchase your copy, DVD, or digital download, and let us know your theory, because now you know Bill Apters. Yeah, what, what is your theory? Hmm.